Hello and welcome to Kelham Park for today's Evo Stick Premier League clash between AFC Fylde and Stocksbridge Park Steel. AFC Fylde came into the game sitting 13th in the Evo Stick Premier League. Three points today could see them rise to 12th and take over Ilkston. They come into the game after, a ga after their game in midweek was postponed away to Hednesford. Their last two games have resulted in losses, however, to their close rivals Chorley and FC United of Manchester. Their next five games will all be played away from Kelmer Park, so David Chalner's men will be keen to sign off with a win today. Stocksbridge, currently 21st in the Evo Stick Premier League, are currently sat nine points ahead of Eastwood Town, who are bottom. However, three points today could take them up to 19th, but I will cut into that gap between them and safety. But they are without a win since the 5th of January and have drawn three of their last three games. To the game then, and it was the first half largely dominated by the home side from the early stages. Fowl created a lot of early chances which tested the Stocksbridge defence, who would equal to them. The few chances the visitors did have never really threatened Fowl's goal and standing keeper Ashley Firth was fairly unchallenged. Fowl got back on top and even took the lead on 16 minutes to Joe Booth after he tapped Holmes and Michael Barnes cross. Even a goal up, Fowl continued to press and created two more great chances before half-time, but were unable to find a second goal. Fowl did eventually make it 2-0 after some great passing play saw the ball land at the feet of Michael Barnes who hit the ball goalwards to extend the home side's lead. A fairly uneventful second half ended with a bang as Fowl scored two in two minutes right at the depth. Firstly, a contentious handball decision allowed Fowl to play on and when the ball came into the box, Joe Bood was on hand to put the ball in the net. Two minutes later, substitute Adam Carden scored his first goal for the club after James Dean's effort fell to, fell to him to tap home into an empty net and make it 4 0. <laughs> Foul pushed for a fifth goal but were unable to score again and saw a very comfortable victory out to the end. Yeah, it was an important game for us, um, and a game we had to win. Really good to come on the on the right side of the result. Um, I suppose the only the only disappointment is we we probably should have been out of sight long before we were. Um, and the scoreline in the end probably is a, is a reflect well, is a reflection of the game. Um, and our manager, quite honestly, has, has said that we deserve to get out at half time, um, such as our dominance. And I suppose that's the only the only thing really you leave. Teams um, still a chance to, to, whether it be a mistake or something, can get them back in the game. So it was nice to um, to go and get the second and the third and eventually the fourth, um, just to put, like I say, a true reflection on um, our dominance really throughout the game. 